Hi, I'm Sue. Swinton have asked me to show you how to keep out flood water from your home. So I'm here at Georgie's house. Some of what we'll show you are easy jobs, some are bigger jobs. So always consider the cost and implications to your house. And remember, this is to help with flood water from heavy rain, rivers breaking their banks, that sort of thing. This advice won't really be effective with groundwater, which is when water comes up through the ground. There's a reason that people are always using sandbags when you see flooding on the news. It works as a first line of defence. It's generally best to stack them about three high, as once you get above five, the wall can become unstable. These days, you can also get automatic flood-proof doors and windows, or you can have your door entrance raised to make it harder for water to get in. This is one of those bigger jobs. Pointing. If it's flaking away, it's time to get it looked at. You can also apply a waterproof sealant to bricks, or even get specially designed covers that fit over brickwork. Outside water can get in through floors and walls. Just having a garden can help water drain away from your home. But if you can landscape a garden or a driveway so it diverts water away from your house, that's even better. OK, there's some handy ways you can try and keep flood water out of your house. For more tips in our how-to series, just click the link here. Or for a printable version of this how-to, just visit swinton.co.uk. Our how-to videos bring you handy hints, which we hope will save you time and money. But please remember, this video is a general one and may not be suitable for your specific purpose. This video is not intended as a substitute for professional help or guidance. Always speak to a trained professional and, where applicable, always consult Manufacturer's Handbook.